place like Camden is difficult because there's not really much to do outside. They don't have like, you know, you, you go to the park and it's like, it's just nothing but trouble there sometimes. So it's like, you're trying to stay away from the streets. You're not trying, you know, wherever you go, there's like drugs all over the place. You see everything. Living in Camden is okay, but it's a lot of drugs in the streets, a lot of fights, a lot of guns, there's a, a lot of stuff around. In Cherry Hill, there's, it's not allowed drugs. Drugs is not allowed. Um, it's really different from here in Camden. In every corner in Camden, there is a drug dealer. You're not trying to spend any time outside and get caught at the wrong place at the wrong time, so it's like you stay home. And then at home, you're not doing anything. You're not learning anything. You're just sitting at home doing basically nothing. So you hurt every day, people dying. So you just stay home and don't do nothing at all. You can't even go out and experience new things. That's what his life is like in Camden. There's a lot of things that happen here that make life difficult. But there's also a lot of things that make life possible. And HopeWorks is about focusing and striving for the possible, for the life, for the hope that exists. That's why we're here. We've decided to plant our stake at a very difficult place, a place that can be violent, a place where people can feel very discouraged, where oftentimes they feel like they can't go forward. And we say that they can. We say that there is a future and that there is possibility and that we want to work with them, the youth, to make that possible. My dream is to graduate from uh, Camden County College while maintaining my job at HopeWorks. My dream is to be a pediatrician. My dream, my ultimate dream, is to go to college and study architecture. My dream is to be a graphic designer and be a dancer. My dream is to become a physical therapist. My dream is to be a business major and run my own business. So we talk a lot about dreams at HopeWorks. And we talk about it in a special way. We talk about it as something that's achievable, that it's dynamic, it's real, it's effective, that it makes a difference, that you can see it. These are our dreams. And why do we talk about dreams? Because dreams are the stuff of hope. Hi, I'm Wesley. We're here at HopeWorks today. All right here we have Jamar. Um, we have Janina, uh, we have Raina, we have Jeffrey doing his work. Whole Books is a wonderful place because you're learning on your own, you're learning by yourself. You're not, it's not like you're just hearing a teacher lecture you like about oh, how you do this, how you do that. You're actually doing the stuff, you're doing the curriculum on your own. We have a web design business that we run on the second floor and that's something me, myself, and trying to be a part of. I'd actually like, really like to get a job in the web design division of HopeWorks. When people ask me about HopeWorks, I tell them it's a great place. I tell them how I made maps in HopeWorks, how I made websites. I go online and I show them my websites. I'm really proud of what I do here. This summer our project is to make a map of the Camden area. Right now we are working on fixing the street labels for our map. Basically we're using a file from ArcMap, which is a satellite view and we're looking over our streets again to make sure that streets that aren't there are put in and the streets that are there are taken out. Did you do this part today? We provide training, we provide jobs, we provide literacy, we help people have corporate internships, we soon will provide housing for youth. We respond to practical everyday needs that youth have. Sabrina, tell me about your goals this week. Um, my main goal is to finish out the Everyone, y'all know Anthony. Anthony's been here for about a month now, and he just completed Photoshop. What is it that you want to do tomorrow? What's your, your goal? My goal is to get these top nine time tables and my top time tables done. And I'm in my head. You think we can do it by tomorrow? Yes. HopeWorks is a community. We help each other, whether it be through literacy, through our day training program. Basically, we all have the same goal of getting to college. And like a community, we try as hard as possible to help each other obtain that goal. It's a very transparent picture, small picture. For the last year, year and a half, we've been kicking around an idea here at HopeWorks about housing. 
and how important housing is to the youth that we work with, especially our college-bound youth. That oftentimes people can plan, they can have their dream plan, they can be doing all these things to help themselves, and yet they can be living in an unsafe or insecure place. And it all comes down on them, and they lose their college. We're calling it the CRIB. CRIB standing for Community Responding and Belief. It's community because it's all of us. It's all of Hope Works. It's not just six people or eight people or 12 people who will have housing, but it's all of Hope Works that responds to the youth in need. That sounds, that's, that sounds pretty good because all at the same time when you're living in the Hope Works dream house, you have everybody in the same, it's almost in the same level. So it's just communicating with each other, helping each other out when you need help. And it's just, it's great. So when I need help from school, then I can just go to somebody that's in the house and great. It's great. I think it's a great idea. The whole package equals success, basically. So Hope Works does it all. Like You come here, you uh, not only learn how to work with computers and get the chance to earn a job, you also get to, the chance to learn academics and stuff have one-on-one -on -one formation with somebody who helps you uh, talk about your plans, you know, get a break throughout the week just to talk about how your week's been going and stuff like that. So, it's all of it in one. When I first came in, I just, I fell in love with it, to be honest with you, because it's like, this is a place where everybody who either hasn't had a high school diploma or even a GED should at least try to get into it because you're surrounded by so many people who do nothing but encourage you, who do nothing but sit there and like, okay, that's awesome. Let's go to the next step and keep you moving. You know, they actually help you bring stuff structure to a life that has no structure. I didn't think I was gonna have a chance to go back to school until I came to homeworks. So this is like a second chance to for me and for my daughter for me to be successful in my life. What we do at HopeWorks is we actually have to dream and we have to hope for youth when hope is difficult and when dreaming seems almost impossible. We actually believe on behalf of the youth at times. But what's really awesome is to watch it unfold and watch a youth begin to grab their own dream so that they are the ones who become the dreamers. They are the ones who become filled with hope. They are the ones who move into the future. After high school, I want to go to college. That's my ultimate goal, to go to college. My dream is to go to college at the high school and be in accounting. Go to college at Camden County, get my associate's degree out there. I would like to transfer to the Art Institute of Philadelphia. My dreams are to, you know, live a successful life, do what I want to do and complete all my goals. 